How's it going out there? Welcome from H2 Tech Video. Today I want to show you how to disable the Facebook timeline. So right now, this is my Facebook page here, and it, it has the timeline look to it. And so, if you want to disable this and go back to the uh, original look that the profiles were, I'm going to show you how to do that. First thing you're going to do is you're going to go to www.google.com slash chrome and you're going to download Google Chrome on your computer. Google Chrome is a browser just like Internet Explorer but it has uh, millions of other features you can take advantage of. Click on download Chrome and go ahead and press accept and install and from this point it's going to take maybe like a minute or a minute and a half to actually install it. Um, if you already have Chrome you can go ahead and jump ahead about two minutes in the video to uh, after I install Chrome and I'll show you exactly what to do to uh, disable the Facebook timeline okay don't worry I won't, my feelings won't be hurt just kidding um, so this part's gonna take a second and you just kinda wait for the different prompts to go by it's gonna connect download and install so uh, we're gonna be a little patient here Give it a little bit of time. Alright, so now the download is complete. Now it's going to pause for a second. And then a new window is going to pop up and it's going to say it's installing. So basically, we want to go ahead and we can minimize this for now. And actually. Let me pull this back up, and while that's doing that, I'm going to pull up my, um, um, my Facebook again. I'm going to show you the before and after product, what we're going to do here. So, um, this is, again, my profile that is in timeline format, and I minimize that. And now the installation is happening. It's You'll know it's finished when uh, right over here in the corner you're going to see Google Chrome and the little symbol before it's going to pop up. It's going to be like red, green, yellow. And then we will open it up. And then from there it's smooth sailing. So a couple more seconds and this will be done and done. Maybe. There we go. So. There it is, this Google Chrome. We're gonna go ahead and double click on it. Actually, usually it'll if you wait a second it'll launch on its own. This is the last part, the installation the computer may ask you to put in your administrator password to install the program. But here it is. Chrome is gonna open up and the first thing it's gonna ask you to do is to uh, put in your Gmail account. Now if you don't have a Gmail, you're gonna to have to click on create a Google account and you'll create one real quick. It takes like Literally less than two minutes. I already have an account, so I'm gonna go ahead and just type it in here. All right, so now it's gonna sign me in. And this is the first thing you'll see. You're gonna see the Chrome Web Store. Click on the Chrome Web Store. And the Chrome Web Store is pretty cool because basically um, it allows you to like download uh, games, special little plugins uh, for your browser that like Internet Explorer doesn't allow you to do. Safari doesn't allow you to do it. Uh, so you can download all these little extras to make your um, web surfing experience funner. So anyway. Here's the web store right here. We, you're gonna type in, type in disable Facebook timeline. And then we're gonna press enter. And this is gonna pop up timeline remover. Okay, a little puzzle piece. Go ahead and click on add to Chrome. We just did. And now it's going to install the app to your Google Chrome. And now, go ahead and type in Facebook. We're going to go back to our Facebook. And we're going to sign in. And now 
for now. Put an email. Time for the magic. Okay. And then click on your profile. Here it is. Are you ready? Are you ready to see your original? Bam! There it is. And there is your profile, but not in the timeline format. Back to the original look of Facebook. So, this is how you change your Facebook to the original format. Okay? And. Here, there's a couple things about this though. Uh, this only works if you're running Google Chrome as your web browser. So if you're running Internet Explorer, uh, you won't see this look. It's going to go back. In fact, let me show you right now. If I jump back to Internet Explorer, even if I refresh the page, it's still going to show my profile in the timeline look. Okay, so. That's the only thing. If you want to be able to see it in the original look, you have to be running Google Chrome. And Chrome is free, just like Internet Explorer, but it has a bunch of extra features built in. So, in a nutshell, that's how you switch your timeline back to the original look. Uh, again, unfortunately, it doesn't keep the look if you're not using Chrome, but I definitely encourage you to try Chrome out. It's a great browser. There's uh, so many more things you can do with it than Internet Explorer. And um, anyway, hope you found this helpful. If you like it, uh, if you found it helpful, go ahead and like the video. Uh, subscribe to H2 Tech Videos and keep watching. And have a good one.